BradyNola.com with Coach Joy Latino, a Jesuit. You guys are outright District 958 Catholic League champions. How good does it feel? Feels great. Um, I'm just excited for the boys, uh, particularly our seniors, uh, for the school community, um, all the alums, you know, uh, everybody that's been watching us and pulling for us throughout the year. This is uh, it's very gratifying. And when they were up 3-0 after that first inning, what was the mindset of the team to be able to battle back in this game and ultimately take this game over? Just just stay poised, you know, stay in control. Um, I, I told them after the game, the thing that I've, I've come to like most about them is, uh, you know, th there's no sense of panic. Um, we were facing a very good pitcher in Blair Frederick, uh, but we felt like if we just kept battling pitch to pitch that we were going to get our opportunities. And once we did, we were able to capitalize. And talk about the ability of Lashardi down 3-2 to with two outs to be able to just launch that thing right out of the park. Well, I, I'm, I couldn't be happier for that young man. You know, uh, he's, he's had to be patient. He's had to wait his time. And I know that's a frustrating thing for, for a player like himself. Uh, he's a very uh, tough competitor. And uh, he got his chance tonight. And he made the most of it. That really energizes. You know, it ties the game, but more so um, it, it put a lot of energy in there. I dug out and got us rolling. And also the mindset of your pitcher, Bruglio, after giving up a home run to able to, you know, settle down. And had, he, he, he retired 11 straight batters in the game. Talk yeah. about his performance. Well, you know, he made the one mistake in the first inning. And I give Dolly credit. You know, when good hitters, when you make a mistake to them, they're going to make you pay for it. it. It was supposed to be a curveball in the dirt. He left it about thigh high and that, that kid pummeled it. Um, but after that, he settled in. He started to locate a lot better, kept his curveball down in the zone, and uh, let his defense work behind him. What are you going to talk to the guys about as you guys head for another playoff push? Uh, just not to be satisfied with what we've done. Certainly, we're, we're happy with uh, with the district championship, um, you know. but there's there's other things to play for now. And, and we want to stay process-oriented. We want to keep working. Uh, we want to take advantage of practice time tomorrow and get ready for uh, another game on Saturday and then uh, put our focus squarely on the playoffs after that. Is it always a little sweeter to be able to do it against the Crusaders? Uh, yeah, you know, Mark and I go way back. We're, we're good friends. We have a lot of uh, mutual respect for each other. Um, you know, to do it here on, on this field tonight um, against a very good opponent uh, makes it a little bit sweeter. All right, Coach. Thanks so much. All right. Thank you.